This is a gaming suit that shocks you when your character gets hurt in video games like GTA. Oh! 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 So when my character gets damaged in the game, I feel pain in real life. Because my goal is to see how realistic I can make video games. So I bought a ton of futuristic gaming gear to try out. My plan is to play four games, each introducing a new level of immersion hardware. Like this gaming treadmill, which makes me walk in real life to make my character move in the game. But during the last game, I'll be combining all the gaming technology together. Which in theory, will give me the most immersive gaming experience possible. But before you can play any games, you need to set up the suit with your pain tolerance. Which ranges from level 1 to 100. Alright, this is the initial calibration. Ah. This is nuts. Okay, we're calibrating. So, let me know when you're done. Oh! Ah! What the fuck? To calibrate the pain vest, you dial up the intensity until you tap out. <laughs> okay, it's going! It's going! Stop! What you can't see right now is the insides of these vests are covered in pads that electrocute me in response to things happening in games. Ah! I'm good! I'm good! I'm good! <laughs> it felt like I was giving birth there. Really? Can I try? Yeah. No, 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 no. He's just gonna turn it up to 100 like a f asshole. <laughs> We're about to play GTA. The police are gonna be attacking me. I've decided I'm gonna become five star wanted and then I can move on to the next game. You're all set. You should feel every sensation. No, really? Wait, I'm gonna shoot real quick. Ow! <laughs> what the hell? Every time I shoot, it electrocutes me. Well, I don't wanna go anywhere. I'm gonna hide in this corner by the staff only door. And, wait, okay, I gotta. Calling uh, Deontay? No, that name. Oh, detonate. <laughs> Something I really miss about video games is how they used to be an escape for me. Like, you can have a crappy day at school or work, but then plug into a game and become immersed in a new world where nothing in the real world matters. And I miss that feeling a lot. So my hope is that this gaming tech will be a fun way to bring that back. I gotta kill this dude? Well, that's gonna hurt me more than it's gonna hurt you, man. Trust me. Oh! I have not been this into a video game all oh, since I was a child! Ugh. Kick the door, I'm gonna die. Oh, why did it shock me when I opened the door? Oh, 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 why is it shocking me right now? It does it without when I drive? Ow! Oh, ow, how am I supposed to do anything? Oh, there's so many of them. Ow, 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 ow! Gosh, okay, I felt bad. I think I got shot. Yeah, you got that one. Oh. After completing the tutorial, I did some other normal things in the game, like hurt people, crash some cars, ah! Ah! accidentally stumble on a military base. Whoa. Oh, I'm at five star already, Willie. What the hell's going on? Uh, sorry. How do you fly a helicopter in GTA? Let's find out. Oh, okay. All right, go ahead. How do I shoot? How do I shoot in this thing? Oh! I would say that about sums up GTA. I got two vests. My friends just showed up over here. We got CJ, Efron, and Tylor. Tylor lives here, he didn't just show up. And since the goal today is to make video games as realistic as possible, I have some other tech we'll try out later. But first, the plan is to add a second pain vest and play co-op Fortnite. So we suited up and set up my friend's pain tolerance. We're gonna set your maximum. 50 on this one? Oh, stop, stop, stop. Oh, stop, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> oh. Wow, okay. <laughs> That was 10. You're crying. Nice. Wow! <laughs> I also increased my own calibration because I want to become more immersed in every game I try. <laughs> oh, that was so bad. One of them is like, oh god, okay. So the goal here is to play Fortnite until we win and get a victory royale. Ow! Oh, oh, what the hell? It just shocked me. My friends and I pretty quickly learned that Fortnite has a lot more program for these suits than GTA. Some things you would expect, like jumping out of the bus makes your chest and abs tingle from the wind. Oh! Oh! Shooting makes you feel recoil in your arm. Oh, 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 oh. And getting shot hurts when the bullet hits your character. Oh. Oh. But what we didn't expect is things like healing still shocks you. Oh! Ow, what the f Eating bananas pays you! Ow! Oh! Ow, oh, oh, it hurts! God. Oh, is that health? Yeah. Oh, I thought that was a grenade! Oh. Ow, 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 ow! So apparently when you go down in Fortnite, the funniest thing happens. It feels like it's trying to simulate death and shocks every pet on your body. And it doesn't stop until you die. Ow! 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 Ow!
Yes! While the pain vest does make you feel the games, it doesn't really immerse you in them. And I want to be fully immersed. So naturally, I decided to invest in more futuristic gaming tech. It's gonna really put us immersive in here. And that is a VR treadmill. Oh, thank you guys for grabbing that. This treadmill works together with special shoes and a VR headset to give you what they claim is full body synergy. I don't know what that means, but I do know I want to be as immersed in a video game as possible. <laughs> So during the final game, I'll combine the pain vest with the treadmill. But before doing that, I'm gonna practice using the treadmill without getting electrocuted. Which works out because one of my favorite games growing up only works with the treadmill. This is like my childhood game, bro. I play, I've probably put thousands of hours into Skyrim. <laughs> Are you okay? Here, wait, so I'm gonna take my first step in Skyrim. Bro, look at this, I have maces. <laughs> Look at that. We got a storm cloak in front of me. Ah! No way! What happened? I'm walking. Oh, dude, this feels too real. And you look so cool too, bro. Yeah, you look so cool. This is bringing me back so much. When I was a f***ing kid, dude, I'd play this so often and it felt so real. It felt like this feels right now. It felt magical. This feels magical again. Oh, sh Hey, yo, <laughs> yeah, slam. To get practice in on this treadmill, I want to challenge myself to walk an extraordinary distance in Skyrim. Basically, I spawned in the town of Riverwood, and my goal is to walk all the way to Whiterun, which is the equivalent of walking three miles in real life. If you've never played Skyrim before, it's basically medieval GTA, so as long as I don't provoke anyone, this should be really easy. I can't hear any audio, so I don't really know what's happening. Oh, I didn't mean to do that! Oh, Shit! Oh, 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 shit! Run, 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 run! Remember how I said Skyrim is medieval GTA? Well, me accidentally hitting Sven is the equivalent of attacking a cop and instantly getting five stars. Run. That was a mistake! I really didn't mean to do that! Basically, everyone in this game wants me dead now. Ah! 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 Oh, I'll show you what the f with, bitch. Yeah. Push, 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 push. Oh, oh, where is he? Where is he? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, ah. Bro, she's bad. Before I had my girlfriend, I had Aaliyah the Huntress. What's this stop at you? Oh, Dude, no. I don't want to kill you, bro. Dude, everyone's pissed off at you. Yeah, bro, you kind of suck. Dude, I've never killed all these guys before. You sure you played before? <laughs> yes, I've played before. These are all my boys normally. All right, this is very illegal. We just got to do it quickly before they see me. How do you ride a horse? Oh, you don't have to run. I don't have to run, I have a horse. Uh-oh. This, is, this, this is, is it? This is it. Unlock, unlock. Requires oh. key! I gotta kill these guards for it. Got him. Got one. One down, got one. one down, one down. One down. One down. Oh. Oh. I submit. Oh, take me to jail. Okay. He made it! Woo! Yeah. Jail. <laughs> Having learned how to walk in Skyrim, it was finally time for the forest. So dramatic. This game that we're about to get into is gonna be the most intense thing I've ever done. Faster, 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 faster. Done, done, done. We have the fully scaled up pain vest here, the VR treadmill and the VR headset. This is the most realistic video game I've ever played. And we got Efron there for emotional support. He's just gonna get electrocuted. Ty Lord's playing the multiplayer with me. Oh no, it's just the loading screen. I'm scared already. Oh, I'm in a plane. Oh, oh shoot, yeah, we're still living. What the f***ing going down? No. What the f***? What the f***? What the f*** is happening? Oh my god! Ow! <laughs> oh! Oh! Oh my god! Who is that? <laughs> You're so much closer to him. Oh my god. Hi, Lord, you look horrible. Don't look good either. Oh, back up or I'm gonna hurt no. off Ron. Ow! That hurts. That hurts me. When I fall down here, is this gonna hurt? Ah! Okay, so we just got in a plane crash. I had a son named Timmy. He got abducted by a cannibal. And now there's there's everywhere. Vertical. Ow, you fucking. Don't with me. All right, guys. The uh, goals in the forest right now are to start a campfire, build a shelter, and kill a mutant. Ow! Uh, am I good? Hungry. How do I eat? If it's not obvious, I've never played this game before, so I gotta clarify two things. First, the game is basically scary Minecraft, so if you wanna build something like a fire, you need to collect all the resources and assemble them. 
There you go. Now take out your light. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. bend down. There you go. Oh, I'm on fire! Ow! 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 I'm on fire! The second thing is there's two enemies in this game. Cannibals and mutants. You'll see me killing a bunch of these cannibals. They're the equivalent of zombies in Minecraft. A couple hits and they're dead. But I'm not gonna stop until I kill a mutant. They're like the Ender Dragon boss level bitches of this game. Tyler, go get a ton of logs. We need 82 of them. Tyler, don't hit me. Stop! Stop! <laughs> you fucking it's like he You broke our fire, you fucking dumbass! Are you fucking dumb? We're gonna die! Bro, Tyler, they're coming for us, bro. They're coming for us. Hey, I just put some meat on the stove. Can I eat first? Tyler. <laughs> Wait a second. He <laughs> just broke the fire again. Tyler! <laughs> Tyler, fix the fucking fire! Are you scared, Ty? Yes, I'm scared, bro. <laughs> bro, I just saw a movement. No, you didn't. Oh. Best odds of us arriving is if we split up. Tyler, <laughs> you're pissing me off. <laughs> this stick burnt out. Oh, oh no. Oh no, make another one, make another one quick. Uh, Tyler, you <laughs> I was to You're doing that on purpose. <laughs> you're literally just doing. So I can see. Don't give a <laughs> Tyler, get the away from me. <laughs> I already made the fire, it's okay. Uh, Don't touch my <laughs> fire. <laughs> oh, <laughs> we got a cannibal. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, oh. No. Oh, I'll kill you! I swear to fucking God, you'll die! I killed the cannibal! Yeah. Oh, he's still, he's coming! <laughs> Get the f away from me, you! I'll f you up! Ow! Ow! Survived zero. That was the worst thing I've ever experienced. Oh, they're back! You wanna f with me, bitch? You wanna f with me? Oh, f oh. oh, no! I killed that. Oh, it's daytime, daytime. I just killed that. I'll be honest, the first night was rough. The vest was in a constant state of shocking me from the amount of cannibals eating me alive. For the sake of my own well-being, I need to build this house before the sun goes down again. Tyler, I'm building the cabin. If you can make food, please. Check this out. We got the animal. Tyler! <laughs> we don't need the cannibal. Ow, 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 it hurts whenever I swing the axe. Oh, we made a weapon. What'd you make? Oh! You f***ing <laughs> You guys didn't know we are trying to become the most subscribed to Tyler, so if you guys are interested in helping us accomplish that goal, all you have to do is press the subscribe button. It would make my dreams come true. We definitely underestimated how long and tiring it would be to build this giant cabin. Like, it took hours to chop down every tree, walk it back to base, and assemble it log by log. And after three hours of playing the game, we achieved our second goal and it would be safe finally from the cannibals in our new home. It's done! Yeah, let's go. Honestly, I've never felt so fulfilled by anything in my entire life. And so physically, emotionally, and spiritually attached to something. What was that noise? It just broke! What'd you just do? I built the crane. You f***ed us! Alright, new f***ing plan. You're not- you- you need to just f***ing go- go run off into a cave and get eaten by a mutant, okay? You f***ed up. Alright, I'm gonna find a cave. Why? What are, you, what are you gonna do in the cave? You're gonna die. You just told me to go find a cave! Oh yeah, true. The last goal we have is to defeat a mutant, which turns out are actually pretty hard to find. CJ and I ended up walking around the entire map trying to find a mutant's cave. I had already been in here for five hours, which is when it really hit me how tiring and nauseating this gaming setup was. I ended up needing to take breaks and turning off the treadmill so I could keep playing without getting dizzy. Ah! Cannibal? Three of them? Four! Four! Five! Five. There, that means there's a cape right there. That's okay. We can take him. Here he comes. Here he comes. Oh! oh. Are you good at the whole yeah, yeah, yeah. It's my life's work now because I failed everything. <laughs> oh, I found a cave. All right, we're going into the cave right now, bro. It's really creepy in here. I got you. Watch out. Don't let me. Hey, don't let me. Yeah, there's something in here. Oh, I got hit by something. A body. Oh, it was like a little mutant. I killed it. Oh, it goes down one. Yep. All right, let's do it. <gasps> Mutant! Oh my god, the seat broke. I'm stuck. Oh, there's a bunch of them. You're ready to fight, brother. Come here. There's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. Oh my god! It's not a pussy! It's a booty hole! Oh no! Ah! Okay, let's retreat. Let's retreat. The mother is big, bro. 
Yo, she comes at you with that booty hole. She had nine nipples. As I was saying this, I didn't even realize it was dark outside. For the last six hours, my life's only purpose was to complete some random tasks in a game. It made me stressed, hurt, and angry at my friends. Being in war, a wanted criminal, or harassed by cannibals is actually not fun in real life. But I will say, there is no way I end this video without f***ing up this mute. She's doing the booty hole run. Bro, she's got a lot of nipples, bro. Here she is, here she is. Keep shooting, keep shooting. She's dead. Yes! 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 Oh no, what are you doing to her? Oh my god, we're done. Oh. I kind of feel disgusting, to be honest. I don't even, I don't even feel good. I like real life way more. I hope you guys enjoyed this, though. If you guys want to see us do more content like this, definitely subscribe. I love you. I love you. I love you.